Hello microwaves, so nice of you to join me. My name is Woody and welcome back to Man of Medan. Medan. <laughs> I I wanted to make it quick. <laughs> anyway, guys. So last time we just escaped the fisher guys, the fish guys. I I'm gonna call them the fish guys. Yeah, we just escaped the fish guys and uh, now we are on our way out. I don't know why that sounded so strange, but anyway, and we saw a lot of creepy people creeping around the corner of my eye, and that's not very pleasant, so I'm guessing that that I'm gonna see the kid ghost, the ghost kid, the, the thingy, what's that? Ah, you can't fool me, I have like, oh, a, what's that, a little bird head, is that a bird? the heck is this? Okay... It's like... A, a rodent, a, a rat, a rat head. I think. I, I, don't, I don't know, man. What am I, a biologist? Okay. So, the other one was red, this one is black, let's see what's inside. Oh. Okay, so this is before the red one, I think. Thursday 12, the skipper has a KO, uh, the skipper had, oh my god, I can't, the skipper has KO'd the booze for this whole goddamn trip, there's nothing like being sober to make you realize just how quiet this ship is, T just how quiet, why would it be quiet? There was a fight between those dumb schmucks, Wilson and Anderson, right after we sailed, but Ferris nipped that in the bud real quick and it's bad, oh my god. And it's been quiet as a church ever since. I got talking with a feller who had helped load up the ship. He told me they put a bunch of coffins on board. Which isn't so weird... Maybe. Why would they... Wait a second. Coffins? On the ship? What? B, he said that there was some guy who made sure the coffins were all put in one of the holes just right. Real precise, precise, not the treatment you'd get if you were any old grunt. If it got me thinking, who could the, who could it be in those boxes? Oh my fucking god, I can't read today. Uh, I'm thinking that coffins are for them, not for somebody that's already in them. But it's just a hunch. Booz was a bum. Lost Perez said he left drunk after four cups, but I said he was talking balloony. It was like ditch watcher. Perez said they made some hooch from some supplies they lifted. Meeting up later down on 6 to check it out. Saturday 14. Just heard one of the guys here snuck a look at the boxes. Gonna go find him and see what he saw. Maybe he can ha even help me get in to take a look. It's all set, he reckons he can sneak me in. We're gonna take a look tonight, okay? What boxes? The ones with deadly chemicals? That's good. Saturday, uh, Sunday 15. It's all off. The guy who was gonna help me get in the hold has been signed off sick. Doc Finley thinks he's, uh, he's some kind of flake, which might be true, but Miller says it's something else. Something weird about that place. Miller, Miller's kind of a twitcher. Wouldn't want to be caught in a pinch with him, that's for sure. Tuesday 17. Perez said that the boys made more hooch. Too bummed out to sneak and try some, but what else is there to do? News. New batch is worse than the last one, never listening to any damn full idea from Perez again. Saturday 21. Last night I was on duty with Wolowix? Wolowix? Anyway. And goddamn if he didn't creep me out. He got, some, uh, he got spooked and started babbling about some surgeon called Johns. That went Mia in the jungle. Reckoned that Jones and his crew were the ones in the boxes traveling home just like us saps. I sneaked a look and Jesus, there it was, just like the guy in the port had said. All laid out real nice, all glory over each one. If it's Jones in there, they've done him proud. Good old Uncle Sam would, wouldn't leave any of us out there. He'll make sure we all come home, I guess. Okay, so that's all. So, besides having... Oh, them. Besides transporting all those deadly chemicals, I think they're transporting... They were transporting some 
Fallen Soldiers back in back in home, I think. That's what I understand. As you can see, I'm not I'm not able to read at this point in time. But if what I saw was correct, then I am right. And what if I Oh my god, Alex you just fucking spooked the shit out of me. I saw him and I was like, oh my god, another one that's gonna disappear and he didn't and I was like, oh, oh wait, that's Alex. <laughs> okay, let's see. Oh, is that Conrad? Wait a second. No, that's Alex. Alex is attacked by Olsen. I think his name is Olsen. But also, I think that uh, we done goof. I hope we are not gonna come to that. I must take care with Alex. Where the fuck am I going? The camera angle, it's so weird. And all those corridors is like, oh my god. Anyway. Oh, cinematics. Yeah, boy. Finally, we're making some progress over here. I love progress. What are they seeing? I think I see something moving down there. Okay. It's one of the fishermen. Shh. Everyone quiet. I did do they know that we escaped? I mean the guy keeping guard knows, but do they know because they split up? What's that? Fleece? Oh, it's the thing from the boat to make it work. Yeah, 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 yeah. I understand, I understand. Look. It's the distributor cap from the Duke. Yep. You sure? Yeah, I'm sure. <laughs> Is that a sledgehammer? Also, this guy is not Olson. Then who's Olson? Hmm. Okay, so the distributor is uh, I'm gonna go get it. alone. How fortunate. Now's our chance. Now's our chance. Grab it. He had on he had the distributor on him all the time, so. What do you think I've been doing? Oh slick! Nice. Okay. Keep an eye out. That's I mean that's technically watching your back because I'm not doing anything just watching. That looks so much high up, higher up, up, upper. Crap. What? Warren, no man left behind. Get out. Why can you keep an eye on me and then just leave her there without a warning? That's sucky. I don't know what was the, with the thing that I hit with Conrad, the little thing I don't... I didn't saw what was it. I warn you! Why? God damn it, they're taking place! Shut the fuck up, man! But I Where warned her! Arrête de crier, j'essaie d'entendre ce qui se passe. Je crie pas! Ta gueule. Je veux savoir où sont les autres. I'm not sure why is this happening. I mean, I, what was what the doing? I thought we were following them. Gotta keep our distance. This way we can get ahead of them. Let's hope it's faster. I don't understand, man. I got this. I don't understand, man. Okay, I'm playing with Alex now, so I must be careful of the fisherman. But uh, that doesn't mean I can't explore shit around here. What's this? What's with the makeshift chapel? Oh, good God. Why do I need to see this now? To all crew, Area 7C has been converted to a temporary chapel of rest for the duration of the voyage. All crew are required to be silent and respectful when passing near sector uh, Section 7C. Well, that seems nice. I mean, okay. 
I don't know if the section 3A or 7C are meaningful in a way or another. I I would think that 3 3A is, but 7C, I mean, I think they're just random clues and stuff like that. What the fuck? Where the fuck am I? Okay, nothing here. They just let you backtrack for a bit, but with no real meaning. Like, why would you do that? And most importantly, where the fuck am I? What was that? What was what? Oh, but we were stationary. How would we hit the iceberg? The power of the ghost compels the ship to. The ship will be like, oh shit, and hits an iceberg or something like that. I don't know, man. I'm expecting another person to appear just before me or right next to me. Look at this uh, camera angle and tell me that is not the creepiest shit you ever saw. Hmm. I'm expecting a jump scare. So. I don't think either. Oh, I swear we've been here before, Alex. Mm. Have you been leading us in circles? We on, guys, haven't. And also was. <laughs> Holy fuck! Holy fuck! <laughs> oh sh fuck! Oh my God! One after Alex? one after the what other. Oh my God! <laughs> For yourself. You don't have to be bitch about it, though. Well, there's a lot of smoke on the ground if you look here and there. Uh, I don't know if that has a meaning or not. I mean, are we affected by that smoke or not? Is this a knife? Huh. Can I use it though? Hey, easy with that. We shouldn't be screwing around right now. Nice blade. Could make a nice severance package for my assailants if you catch <laughs> my drift. Yep. No, we Guess might need know. it. We might have to use it. I mean, it doesn't. Alex, you don't want to end up hurting the wrong person with that. You should just put it down. It doesn't have to be used. I mean, I, I may be prompted with a choice, and I will just choose not to stabby stabby. You, you understand? I mean, I hope that. That's how it hey, works. According to this, today is beef casserole. Mm, yummy. Mm. It's as if everything just ground to a halt on this one day. I mean, the whole ship just stopped functioning. Yeah, that's how disasters work. Just one day, nothing works anymore. I mean, what did you expect? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know about that remark, Jess. But I don't think that was very, I don't know, clever. Hmm. This is the beef casserole. Yeah, let so me take a sure, sip. Mademoiselle? Oof. As if you know your way around the kitchen. Please, relax. Yeah. Just messing around. I mean, I can understand why she doesn't want him to mess around, but I can also understand messing around. So I'm kind of here in the middle. All right. What is this place? A cafeteria. I think, go through here. I think oh, hey. I see a little picture on the wall, on the wall, on the wall, and I'm gonna die because I'm stupid. Okay, let's. Oh! That's Alex, and that's a knife. Cut your jib. What was that? Cut your jib. What do you mean by cut your jib? What was cut your jib? Oh, that's the name of the... Yep, okay. Let's... I think this... The, the one stabbing uh, Brad... No, it's not... It, it's... I can barely see the hair. No, it, it can't... It can't be Alex. It can't be Alex because... Uh, it has some uh, wavy hair. From what I saw in the movie, so it can't be him. But I mean, who else has that much hair? Besides that little kid. 
What? <laughs> what? What? There's something in here with us. Did, didn't you? I mean, did you hear anything? Yes, but what was it? Oh. I think. Alright, well, we should keep moving. I know I saw something. It was moving in the shadows. What the fuck? Why would rats. I be like that? Probably just rats. That's all it was. Don't fucking laugh at me. It was. A better alternative than the other one. All right, we've been here before. I'm sure of it. We're going around in circles. What do you want to do? Turn around? We've seen all this before. Cool, Jay. We don't have a lot of options, Scott. Okay. No, this isn't working for me. What? Oh, nice. We reached Gross the coffins. Kids and crappy chapels. Not my scene, you know. You're right. It's gross and it's crappy. Yep. Got to get out of here too sweet. And we got to find Fliss. Okay, so can we just get the fuck out then? I mean, I would love to, but What is this? How? Let's uh, look at the graves. What can go wrong in a horror game looking at graves? I mean, oh, yeah, open it. It's even better. How would I do that? Oh. Why there are two skeletons in one? Look at this. It's insane. Is it even human? I mean, what? Was it ever human? Was it? What is the deal with this place? It's kind that of weird. Bad mojo, dude. Okay, leave. Now. Leave, leave, leave. Why? Nah. <laughs> leave, 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 and she's just going the other way. I mean, why? Hey. Brian Carter. What, on this guy? what are they even doing here? I don't think stuck on a ghost ship for all eternity sounds like a good plan, eh? Why? Who cares where I think they're from good. or where they're going? They're dead and we're not, so let's keep it that way. Okay. Will you please hurry? Oh my god, please. Jess. I hope. I hope it's Jess. But still, I want to see this. Oh my f Freaking hell! This one, like for a kid or something. I don't want to oh, get Jesus. out of here. Yes, maybe that's little baby Dracula, right there. And those are his parents, and they're lying in the dirt from their native country. And, and then they all jump on Conrad and eat off his face. <laughs> the end. Uh, I hear beatings like somebody. Some serious locks in these caskets. Why would they be chained and locked? Ah, oh, good well, question. That's one way to end a relationship. Oh my god, Conrad. This is neither the place, the time, or the... What's the matter? Time. Shh. Bang! Oh. Oh my god. <gasps> oh, fuck. fuck. Seriously? Are you trying to freak me out? Huh? What? Can we just get out of here? Oh my god, we're having hallucinations. Oh my fucking god, the guests affecting us. I, I now understand why uh, was Conrad seeing people all around. We're starting to lo lose it. Roger that. We gotta get place. No time to lose. Yep, yep, no. I, 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 don't, I don't want to stop anymore and I don't think I should. I don't care. I, as long as we're not gonna die from it. Oh my god, we're back at the beginning when we first saw the <laughs> Hey, this is no time to be fucking around. I'm serious. I can't take it. Oh Jesus. Fucking Christ. Fucking Christ, man. Fucking Christ. Where's Conrad? Conrad, you fucking piece of bitch. Where are you? Where the hell is Conrad? Yeah. Conrad? That's Maybe what. Get him some air. Yeah, sure. Conrad! Oh my god, this guy wasn't in surgery. And there's the surgeon. 
uh, before going there and there and everywhere else, I kind of feel like this is important. Okay, let's see what we do we have okay, here. Okay, so this guy had appendicitis, which is pretty routine, and then, then he died of a massive heart attack, which is not routine at all. Huh. Hashtag nope. Nope. Yep. I feel both of them. How how did that happen? Hell? Looks like he died of fright. You can't see that. Yep. I, I I said something like that. So it's like the thing I mean I don't think the gas per se kills you. It's more like the things that you see from the gas. Maybe it destroys your I didn't like that camera angle. It destroys Connie? Connie! Okay, where's Conrad now? I thought it was just Connie, going for further than usual. How where do we Conrad? lose him? He must have gone on ahead. Yep, hey, no, fuck that. We're sticking together. We are a team Where and we need to support go? each other. But still, where's the fuck? That fu oh, fuck. Who got that? It was one of the fishermen who got the sledgehammer, right? So this could be one of the fishermen's or bread because bread maybe somehow uh, knocked him out or something. I mean, I don't know. Okay, we're back with Fliss. So Where are you taking me? Now why would I tell you? It's not like I'm not gonna find out or something like that, so Okay. And we're just going forward and you're gonna remain there. Tell me where we are going, damn it! It's not like you would know we're going to room 3C and you're gonna be like, Oh, the 3C, why didn't you say so? I know exactly where it is. Like, those kind of questions. I mean, I know she doesn't want the exact room. She wants a general, general location. Hey, take off. Leave that alone. I thought she that, that pickup action is gonna be quicker. And I would have time to even know what slap doing. his head. You just do whatever he tells you, don't you? I, 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 can I escape now? Can I do something on this route that could help me? Hmm. Oh. Stop. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Okay, so this is starting to get way creepier than it should. I still didn't saw it. Wait a second, can I go back? Can can you go back? Just come on. Oh god, fucking dead. I saw something there. The the red big red button. I thought I could interact with it. Bye. Have a great time. Bye. 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 Oh, I was I supposed to go here? I thought I was supposed to move forward. Well. Oh Jesus fucking Christ. Alright, come out! Show yourself! That's just a cat and some garbage. Damn it! Okay. There's a lot, a lot of gas here, around here. This fucking place is cursed. Tell me about it. Look at this. Okay. But that was obvious like What would you expect? I mean, the name is important that ends with G. What was that noise? What are you talking about? I don't want to hear anything from you. I don't want to hear anything from me either, boy, but we don't have a choice. You know about that? Oh, flickering light. 
Oh, fuck. 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 How many cheap jump scares are we away from the real jump scares? Please, you don't have to do this. Please don't. Keep moving. No. I don't want to. Come on. Jesus! Oh Christ. Oh Christ. That guy. That guy's probably still right here with us. I what? Mean, you die on a ship? Your ghost stays on the ship. You okay? Hang on. You have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> no, she's the... Okay, I'm gonna inspect him. That's... I mean... <sighs> what? Hmm. Where did all your friends go? Around? I don't know what the fuck this is all about. But we gotta keep moving and find Olsen. Now. Okay. Secret found. Good. So I'm gonna end this here. Olsen? Man. Guess what you fed? So. I'm gonna end it here. Because we're running out of time. And uh, I want to stop just right before the, the good shit starts. And I think this is a place for good shits. So this episode wasn't much of anything. It's like a transition episode. You, you know, you need to have some fillers here and there. So you enjoy a, a series to its max potential. So yeah, we just move around a bit. We lost fucking Conrad. I don't know how because he was right next to us. Freeze was taken away. I don't know why, because I warned her that someone is coming. And now Alex and Jess are all alone. And uh, Alex is going insane. Because he sees a lot of shit that isn't actually there. Or he sees the real shit that is actually there. And Jess is not seeing... Oh, I'm fucking... I don't fucking know. We're just gonna see and wait. Uh, what's really going on. I'm guessing... It's a combination of this gas and ghosts or something like that. Either this or a lot of hallucinations, man, like you, LCD levels of LSD levels of hallucinations. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. Cheers to you. And we'll see each other next time. Bye.